Have you ever had trouble with a key when it just wouldn't fit into the lock? You, it's very frustrating. It's so frustrating. Yeah. Well, a Knoxville woman says she can't open her mailbox with the key. The mail is delivered to cluster boxes at her apartment complex, and it seems no one can help. So you know what she did? She called WATE 6 on your side's <laughs> consumer reporter Don Dare to see if he could help. Did we did kind of, Lori. This, this was in a very unusual and pretty aggravating situation for Marie Vesser. For nearly two weeks, she's been unable to open her mailbox. We looked at the key. It's not bent. We looked at the key lock. Nothing seems to be obstructing it. But she was never able to get any help. So we called the Postal Service. You've lived in the apartment how long? About six years. You've never had any trouble with your mailbox before? No, never. Let's see right now. Marie Vesser's mailbox won't open. With the key firmly in the lock, it, it doesn't turn. You could be missing some important mail. That's right. And I'm pretty upset about it. And no help. I have bills to pay. I have important letters uh, from the state coming because uh, it's open enrollment for insurance. Been waiting on that. And I can't get anybody to help me. There are a lot of mailboxes here. Have you talked to some of your neighbors? Are they having trouble? No, they're not having trouble. Ms. Vesser lives at the Pine Ridge apartment complex. When the postal carrier delivers the mail, Marie says she's at work. So she called the apartment's office and maintenance department for help. They came out, tried WD-40, and said there's really nothing we can do. You need to take it up with the post office. So she went to the closest post office in the Norwood community. It's on Clinton Highway, where she talked with a clerk. Well, she got on the phone to her supervisor and said, uh, we'll look into it. Uh, maybe we could have the mail carrier figure out what's wrong. Mm -hmm. Well, that was a week ago. There's some remodeling underway at her apartment complex. Ms. Vesser says the cluster mailboxes were moved recently. So just, you know, right in this area. She showed us where the mailboxes were originally located. A new sidewalk is under construction there, and the cluster boxes will go back to the site. However, Marie says her mail slot didn't open even before the boxes were moved. She showed us a copy of a written letter sent to the post office recently requesting help. She even called them. Talked to a lady and I told her I'd already made four phone calls. Nobody's helping me. She gave me another phone number to call. I uh, let that ring for three minutes because I timed it and it ended up hanging up on me. In September, we reported that no mail had been delivered to Rick McLaney's house for weeks after he had gone on vacation. In August, he sent this form asking the post office to hold his mail until he returned. But it was never resumed once he came home from vacation. We contacted the post office in East Knoxville, and within days, Rick's mail was delivered to his home. The post office tells Six on Your Side repairs to Marie Vesser's mail slot will be made as soon as possible. I just want my mail and somebody to listen to and maybe be approachable on the phone. Well, finally, she will be getting her mail soon. Several hours ago, a supervisor at Knoxville's main post office called Marie and said the mailbox needs a new lock, that a work order has been placed and the box will be repaired soon. But once it is fixed, Marie will be given a new key, and then she'll have to pay a $35 fee for that new key. Until the box is fixed, she's been given information as to where she can go to pick up the mail that she's been missing, Bo.